Howdy folks, Max Caveman here bringing you to my Scarlet and Violet Elite Trainer Box openings. Uh, so here today I have a uh, well, both versions of it and I'm going to open both in this ver uh, video and we'll do a little bit of a pack battle seeing which one is a bit better. Um, so let's jump into this. Um, I am really looking forward to getting a lot of packs. Um, I do have my case to open, uh, which will be coming shortly on the channel, hopefully in the next day or so. Um, but let's see what we get in here. Uh, so if you are not aware, the um, boxes have actually changed. Uh, so I believe what's going to happen now is each of these is going to have a specific promo card in them um, and we get an additional pack so that is something that I will be looking forward to um, like always you do get a player's guide um, I'm going to do another video just after this one where I go through this and have a look and basically explain what I am searching for in this set rather than say it at the start of each of my opening videos. Okay, so we got, um, that's actually quite interesting, so this would be the, oh these are the condition counters, okay, um, that actually looks so much better than the, um, well, it's hit and miss. Um, I think they look a bit better. Took a sec. Um, we do get dividers in each of these. Let's just. So, two sets of the condition counters. We do get two sets of dice. Um, with the. Um, the D main D6 here changing depending on which box you get, but I would have preferred the damage counters to be a combination of the red and purple. Um, I think that could have been a bit better. Um, a bit like how we got these two. Uh, so, whoops. So, each box does get um, four of these dividers, um, which do change for each of it, uh, depending on the version. We do get a stack of energy each. Um, really good because we now have the eroded text saying basic and then the energy type. Uh, I'm a little disappointed in just the basic swirl for it. Um, then we do get these two. Uh, we get the Maridon and Crydon depending on the box you get. Um, these are just alternate arts. Absolutely beautiful. I am leaning more towards this artwork. Um, but that's it. Uh, we do get two code cards here. One for each box. And then a pack of, I believe this will be 65 sleeves. Um, I personally will use these for build and battle, like the pre-release events. These aren't best for main use. Um, and then we do get nine packs now for each ETB. Um, hopefully that's what's going to be going forward. Um, they did increase the price, so we do get the um, promo and an additional pack. But, let's see, which one gets the better pulls out of the booster packs, the Scarlet or Violet? So, I'm going to start with the Violet. And I believe all the code cards should be the same now. And it's one card from the back to get an energy. 
Okay, so we've got a Fire Energy, Drowsy, Nimona, Lechonk, Flavebe, Lucario, a Rocky Chestplate, it's a Titan, a Professor's Research, and they did update the Reverse Hollows, I much, I really enjoy those, and we got the Cyclozar. Okay, we've got a Water Energy, Chocodet, Mankey, Capsicid, Potion, Oinclone, Spiritomb, Ultra Ball, Energy Switch, a Clef Key, and a, um, the regular version of the Clef Key. We have a Psychic Energy, Growlithe. Star Ravia, Roltz, Tandemouse, Team Star Grunt, Zangoose, Youngster, a Reverse Tarantula, a Reverse Shuppet, and a Hollow, well, a regular rare um, Halucha. Um, if you didn't know, you, you, well, you probably have been able to see, we do get an additional Reverse Hollow. Um, so I believe you get a reverse holo regardless now, and at least a holo rare. Um, and they have dropped the non-holo rares from sets, as well as the rainbow rare. Uh, anyway, we've got a Fighting Energy, Boizel, Energy Retrieval, Lechonk, Slowpoke, Esparthra, Arvin, Cacturn, Reverse Spupa, Reverse Muck, and we get our first decent pull, a Gardevoir EX. Back on the EX mechanic now. Um, probably for the best. Um, the Vs are a bit too much of a, oh, I play it and then I have a decent sized body on the field. Now we have to put the work in for all the um, for the payout. Okay, we've got a lightning energy, a Poke Gear 3.0, Floet, Pommy, oops, let's move that around. We've got a Smoliv, Flaffy, Blissey, Tatsugiri, Reverse Magikarp, Boizel, and a Skeledurge. Now, one thing I did note, having a brief look at the card list online, is that some cards that aren't in here, you have to buy starter decks for, and other products, which is a bit disappointing. I've got a Dark Energy, Wattrell, Zangoose, Krogunk, Dedene, Mesa Gosa, Heracross, Defiance Band, Silicobra, Zangoose, and Annihilate. Okay, we've got a Psychic Energy, Wiglet, Grivard, Mashiv, Spupa, Jacques, Floragato, I've got an XP share, Toxel, Skiddo, and a Professor's Research. Uh, so, two packs remaining here. For the Violet Box, we've got a Fire Energy, Curlia, Switch, Fuecoco, Tropius, Driftblim, Nest Ball, Pachirisu, Mesa Gosa, and we get a nice looking uh, illustration, Bombardier and an Arbeliever. That's a big thing that the gallery cards are back, um, now just simply referred to as illustration rares, um, which I feel is a bit cleaner. And then anything above a basic Pokemon is a special illustration rare. So hopefully I can get quite a few of those. Now we've got a Dark Energy, Dolive, Quaxley. We've got a Ponyard, Crushing Hammer, XP Share, 
Toad's Cruel, Cyclozar, Judge, Primeape, and a Cloth. So, all in all, two semi decent pulls for the Violet box. Uh, just throwing my cards around. So, let's jump on to the Scarlet box now. Okay, so we got a Water Energy Switch, Fuecoco, Tropius, Pokeball, Cyclozar, Toad's Cruel, Mousehold, we've got a Slowpoke, Toxtricity, and a Houndstone. That's actually a really interesting card. I'm going to leave that aside, because I might try and build a deck around it. So we have a Grass Energy, Dead Dene. We've got a Curlia, Switch, Fuecoco, Team Star Grunt, Lucario, Rock Chestplate, a Reverse Squawkabilly, a, t a Pokegear 3.0, and a Maridon. Sadly, I didn't get in the Maridon box, the Violet box, so. And that is the same Maridon as the promo card. Okay, so we've got a Psychic Energy Spupa, Meditite, whoops, Energy Switch Search, Grimer, Driftblim, Defiance Band, Tatsugiri, Watch, uh, Killer Watchrel, Floet, and a Professor's Research. We've got a Fighting Energy, Hound Hour, Drifloon, Drif, Drifloon, Satotl, Varun, Vivalon, Dashman, we've got a Torkoal, Team Star Grunt Reverse, a Palpad, and a King Gambit. So that is actually going to be a potential deck that I am also going to be building. So we've got a Fighting Energy, Riolu, Magneton, Cloritza, Grievart, Katie, Star Raptor, Electric Generator, we've got a Reverse Grievart, and we got this lovely looking Scovillain with a Magnazone EX, a double pull pack. Uh, so that's actually the same pull rate as the previous box so far, just in that one pack. Um, and if I was to separate the two, I would lean towards the um, Scarlet one, simply because I prefer Scovellan over Bombardia. Okay, so we've got a Lightning Energy Varun. Clauncher, Skiddo, Quaxley, Sandaconda, Katie, Star Raptor, Reverse Hound Hour, Quaxley, and a Rever Room. Uh, maybe you have noticed, but some of the, well, most of the, was it, um, Paldea Pokemon that have just been introduced have two printings. Um, different cards entirely, so it gives you a little bit of an option when trying to work out which card you want to evolve into, what well, from. Uh, anyway, we've got a Psychic Energy, Watchrel, Crocorock, Mankey, Squawkabilly, Metajam, Quaxwell, Cyclozar, Krogunk, Electric Generator, and we do get another King Gambit. Okay, we got a Dark Energy, Fido, Scatterbug, Drifloon, Sprigatito, Rock Chestplate, Steam, Team Star Grunt, Zangoose, Toxel, Starly, and an Indeedee. Okay, so this is going to be the final pack for this opening. 
Um, could be something good. I'm pretty satisfied if I get even pulls, so to speak, from um, this these boxes. Uh, obviously, if I do get something else, that would be amazing. But let's see. We've got a Psychic Energy Lachonk, Starly, Tarantula, Wattrell, Flaffy, Youngster, Blissey, a Magneton Reverse, a Reverse Pokeball, and an Arboliva. So that is the final pack, I do believe. So, in the end, um, I did get two of the illustration rares, the Bombardier and the Scovillain, one from each. Um, and then I got the Gardevoir and Magnazone EX, two stage two EXs. Um, so, pretty um, even, I would say, between the two boxes if this was a pack battle. I kind of do think it was. Um, I'll let, let you decide what you think um, was the better box. Um, but you do also get the two promo cards, one for each of them. So, if you want to take that into consideration. But, that's it for this video. I'm so happy to have my hands on some new Scarlet and Violet packs. Um, do have my work cut out for me, trying to design new decks revolving around the EX mechanic, but I think I can manage just right. Um, now, as I said at the start, I will be going through one of these players' handbooks to basically show off what I am after specifically from the set in a video that will be coming up very shortly. So hopefully you'll check that out um, and that will basically be me saying what I want from the set instead of at the start of every episode, well, video, parts, um, whatever you want to call it. Um, so hopefully you enjoyed. Hopefully I'll get to see you again next time. But until then, have a good one, folks.